What is up everyone, this is Mo Gaming here, and today I'm going to show you how to update the DNS server for your Steam Deck. So this is interesting, you actually cannot do it from the regular Steam Deck OS version, you actually have to go into the desktop version, which would be like the, the normal Linux build that Steam has done, you would have to kind of do it from here. So you most of the playarounds, if you want to do with your network settings, you actually will have to do it from here not from the Steam Deck client itself. That kind of sucks. Uh, I'm assuming they'll change it in the future. Like the reason I say this, like even your Nintendo DS, right? Or no, sorry, not DS, Nintendo Switch. You can easily just update the DNS server settings or, or your PlayStation, Xbox, etc., from the console's OS itself, not a, another OS per se, right? So this is like the desktop version where again, I, I would assume, I don't wanna say a lot of people will use it because I feel like people who are using Steam probably will, but Anyways, regardless, like I, the way you want to do this is if you just straight up scroll to the bottom right uh, or take your mouse to the bottom right, you'll see something over here, which will be your internet, like where you can see right now. Mine's connected. It's showing the upload and the downloads. You know, not bad. Uh, and if you want to click into change uh, network configure settings, so you'll see over here, like you'll see the two I had connected. You have your Wi-Fi inf information. Again, you can kind of like play around with a lot of different like MAC addresses and all that good stuff over here if needed. But if you want to do your DNS, you can actually just go over here, change it from automatic into manual, and then just choose this DNS servers and then like the amounts and whatever you want to do. So like just to give you a perspective, you can just do manual, you can do the DNS servers, find them, input them, and then have them like add the, the list of DNS servers here. Um, it's a little, like I said, weird on like how and why you do this. Like I said, it's so much easier on PlayStation, Xbox, Switch, even the computer itself. It's so much easier to do. I'm assuming it's because it's Linux and Steam just it's didn't have it in the built itself that they did so you got to just and you got to make sure which one is yours right you want to make sure like is it ipv6 or ipv4 for you uh, it's usually four but it could be six again that's why if six was technically ignored over here but if it's four for you you're gonna have to kind of like put in the servers here you might have to like even put in over here with the address netmax all that other stuff it depends on like how complicated you want to go but most likely you're going to be messing with like the dns service component over here i use google which is 8.8.8.8 .8 .8 .8, and the alternate is 8.8.4.4 uh, but it's going to kind of like depend on which one you're trying to go with like i said it's technically a computer you can even see all the other settings and whatnot on the side so it's, it's always a little weird on how you gotta like work with <laughs> steam but yeah this is essentially how you do it uh if you guys still have any comments questions because let me know in the comment section i'm more than happy with you guys out if you guys overall like this video please smash that if you guys are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe and click that notification bell. And that, welcome out. Peace.